depending on his mind. First two rows, we've got two guys who have never won a truck race. This could change tonight. A green-white checker finish. It's the third one of 2011, the third time it's happened at Kentucky. Coming back through the trial, Kyle Busch, Jason White, one and two. Green flag back in the air. A good start by Kyle. Look at Elliott Sandler making a three wide per second. Parker Kligerman on the outside trying to take second away as well. Kligerman with the momentum on the outside. He's going to get oh. second away from Elliott Sandler. Elliott got really, really loose. That puts him in the middle of three wide. Jason White back to the bottom trying to grab third away from Sadler. But look at Brendan Gaughan on the outside bringing Todd Bodine with it. Brendan Gaughan moves up to third. Bodine moves into the fourth spot. Can Parker Kligerman reel in the 18? One lap of racing to go when they get to the stripe. White flag in the air. Todd Bodine, we haven't hardly talked about the entire race. He's running fourth right now trying to get third away from his teammate. Parker Kligerman trying to find a way around the 18 of Kyle Busch. Kyle Busch trying to hang on with a truck he didn't think could win tonight. He's got to make two more turns, and it's going to go straight to victory lane, Rick. Kyle Busch in the Dollar General number 18 didn't practice earlier this morning in the truck, but he didn't need it. Victory lane is the next stop for the 18 of Kyle Busch. <laughs> Three wide for the sixth spot. What a battle in that green white checker those guys were having. Elliott Sadler came off the corner eighth and he was able to get back by those two other trucks that were three wide with him. But how about Kyle Busch? We talked about it, Michael. Nobody we would rather have for a lap or two after a restart than Kyle Busch. Impressive finishes for Parker Kligerman. Brendan Gaughan comes home in third. Bodine is fourth. Jason White holds on for a top five.